What's up, Salsa Bros? Today we have... Dude, what are you doing? I'm trying to film. Dude, I had this time slot booked. Dude, I booked this time slot. This is my week. Whatever, I guess I'll be back next week. Sorry about that. Anyways, today we have Wegmans Corn Salsa. So this salsa says it's made with fire roasted tomatoes, poblano peppers, and a touch of heat. So right off the bat, that kind of intrigued me because it said poblano peppers, and you don't typically see those in a lot of salsas. Something different. And of course you get the corn in there, which is also different. So I paid about $3.99 for this. So for a 16 ounce jar, I'm gonna go ahead and give that $3 signs out of five for price. Let's get into it. Okay, so I'm getting onions and peppers. Pretty heavy in the onions. Actually, I don't smell any corn, funny enough. And this one is chunky. I mean, as you can see, you're getting large chunks. They're basically about the size of uh, the corn too, which is, you know, these are whole pieces of corn. So that's chunky too. Okay, they're giving this two peppers out of three on the label. And um, looking at the ingredients, it's got poblano peppers, jalapeno peppers, and some cayenne pepper. So this one should be interesting. Uh, let's see. So that, like I said, this is pretty chunky. I mean, I'm going to go ahead and give that one an 8 out of 10 for chunkiness. First dip. Kind of pumped up. Let's see. Wow, that's interesting. That's got a lot going on to it. It's like a kind of really complex flavor. So I'm not getting any kind of like, like really hot heat. I'm getting like a subtle, you know, I mean, they say with a touch of heat, I guess I'm getting like a touch of spiciness flavor to it. So, you know, by my standards, it's not hot for sure. Um, I think just your average person might not like, you know, you know, reach for their water. Like, oh, wow, that's really hot. It's got like a spiciness to it, which is nice. Uh, it, it kind of, funny enough, it tastes like a like a black pepper kind of spiciness, more than like a, you know, a hot capucin, hot pepper heat spiciness. But it, it's good. It's interesting. I mean, again, it's got those different peppers in it. It's got the corn in it. Uh, it's also got, it's got the fire roasted tomatoes. And I mean, you're really getting that. It's kind of really a, a complex flavor. Yeah. So for heat on my scale. I'm going to give this one like a, like a three out of 10 for heat. Um, but for flavor, you know, that's where it gets more interesting. There's kind of, like I said, it's a lot going on here. I mean, I keep going back for more. It's a bunch of different chunks. I like the complexity. I like the balance. Um, I wasn't sure how I was going to feel about the corn, but I like it. You know, it adds a little bit of touch of sweetness and it really balances everything out well with like this, the, the spiciness to it, the black pepper spiciness. And again, not in like a really hot way, just in a flavorful kind of spice way. And, you know, I do taste the roasted the tomatoes and you get a little bit more of a smoky uh, flavor with these. So I like it. I like the flavor a lot. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and give this one an 8.3 on flavor score. It's definitely good. It makes me want to eat more of it. Wegmans is coming in clutch with this one, you know. And if you look at the ingredients, it's all, there's really not too much to it. Kind of just simple, you know, kind of whole food ingredients. Um... Yeah, no artificial colors, flavor, or preservatives. You know, there's zero added grams of sugar. So it's kind of like a, uh, you know, a healthier salsa, you know, a kind of more minimalistic salsa without throwing a lot of stuff in there, but it's still packing flavor. I'm going to give this one an 8.4 Salsa Bro score. I like it. I'd probably buy this one again. I mean, I would buy this one again, which is funny because it's reminding me of the Wegmans Habanero Salsa. The Wegmans Roasted Habanero Salsa, I did a video on earlier, and I liked it. I really liked it. And if anything, I kind of liked it more even in retrospect, because I was like, wow, like I really want more of that salsa. The last couple times I went grocery shopping, it's like not been there. It's been sold out. This is probably one, just like the Wegmans Roasted Habanero, that I'm going to keep on stock. Just keep it on me. 
keep that thing on me. Let me know if you've had this salsa. Let me know what you think about it. As always, I'll leave you with this.